this video, you will be learning how to use eLab Journal to more efficiently record lab results and track data in your digital lab. To start using eLab Journal, navigate to the Experiment Browser or the Experiment List under Journal and select Add Experiment. Enter a name and check the applicable experiment options, then click Create. Your experiment registration begins with a blank page organised in sections of your choosing. New sections can be added here. We offer a wide variety of sections to fit your needs. Click Add Section, enter a section header and section type to continue. In the New Text section, add text by using the Edit function. Remember to click Save when completed. In addition to standard experiment templates, you may add an existing protocol template within a section of your experiment. Begin by adding a new procedure template section, then select the procedure. With dynamic fields, changes to measurements will adjust the subsequent information automatically. Finish by inserting the procedure template. Except for text sections, you can add sections that hold different types of content, such as a dedicated section to link samples that are used in this particular experiment. After adding a sample section, browse or search for the necessary sample and link it to your experiment. You may also define a new sample straight from your experiment to be stored into the lab's inventory. To link any type of file, such as raw data files, choose the appropriate section type, then upload or link any raw data file to your experiment. You may also link images, label those images and draw on them directly in the notebook. With eLab Journal, you have the option to seamlessly integrate Microsoft Office web tools. Start working a new Excel file or upload an existing one. Create charts and graphs to more easily understand your experiment data. An important function of the all-in-one ELM is seamless collaboration across laboratory activities. Collaborate with your colleagues on an experiment by adding them from a list of lab members. Once logged in, the added user will find the experiment under the Pending Experiments section and on their dashboard. Any edits or updates made by your colleague will be logged and archived. You may also compare or restore previous versions for any deleted sections in the History section. Experiment sections can be easily moved through drag and drop. You may also perform other actions, such as renaming, changing the date of, adding comments to, removing or printing the section. Any removed section can easily be restored. When exporting the experiment as a file, you may select the necessary sections to include. You can also view a log of events and link, sign or complete the experiment. Select Toggle Collapse All Sections for a collapsed view of the sections. 
You also have the option to save your experiment as a template for future use. You may do so by navigating to Experiment Template under Configuration and clicking Add from Existing to find the experiment. Just select Create Template and add a template. If you saved the experiment template after completing the report, you may notice that all contents were copied into the template during the saving process. Simply delete the content so that the template is ready for future use. Now, when adding a new experiment, you have the option to use this pre-configured procedural template for a more efficient experiment process that improves reproductibility and structure in your research. For more information about our products, visit elabnext.com.